I am at Loom in Oakland where I will be trying out eyelash extensions applied by a robot. To be honest, I am terrified when anything gets too close to my eyes. I hate the thought of even using an eyelash curler. So I'm probably the worst, but best tester for this. I first met with a lash artist who walked me through how the robot works, then prepped my lashes. These under eye pads have bars on them to help determine how far down the robot should go when isolating the lashes. The upper eye pads also determine the distance towards the eyes and help your eyelids stay comfortably closed. The robot takes over from there, but the lash artist is there guiding you through it all. You're gonna feel light brushing on your lash line, isolating a natural lash, brushing through here. We're gonna pick up an extension, dip it in adhesive, and slide it right on your lash line here. Perfect. That was it? Yes, that was your first lash. Oh my gosh, I didn't feel anything. Essentially, there are two robots. The first robot's job is to isolate each lash. The second robot picks extensions, dips them in glue, and puts them on the isolated lash. The extensions are cured with a blue light, which keeps them durable and helps them stay on longer. The robot's hands or wands are feather light. If you move, sneeze, or do anything that touches the wands, they'll simply fall off without hurting your eyes. It felt really light on my lashes, almost like a light breeze or putting mascara on. Yeah, I definitely could fall asleep to it. It's almost like the robotic sounds have like a therapeutic element to it. The extensions last an average of three weeks, depending on the client's care and lash shedding cycle. The robot can apply 25 lashes on each eye in about 15 minutes. Then lash artists fill in the remaining extensions. Loom currently offers only one color and curve style, but uses different length extensions to achieve a natural light look. Once the robot is done, the lash artist double checks each lash application and spends some time customizing the look for you. I can't tell the difference between which ones my like natural lashes which one the robot did and which one you did. It looks so good. While pricing is not finalized, Loom hopes to be in the price range of a premium eyelash extension service, which averages $250 per treatment. The team is hoping the technology and speed will lower the price. It's been three weeks since my lash appointment and I think I still have one or two lashes left despite me constantly forgetting and rubbing my eyes. My biggest fear going into this was that the robot wands would pierce through my eyes but after feeling how light they are, I realized that that's practically impossible. My other big concern was whether automated services like this would eventually replace lash artists or people's jobs, but I learned that the robot is mainly there to speed up the service time and to assist the lash artist. I honestly loved and preferred having the lash artist there to really guide me through everything. And she went in herself to add a lot of the lashes to really customize the look and experience.